Hey guys, welcome and welcome back to my channel. My name is Naomi T. Grant. If this is your first time here, if this is not your first time here, thank you so much for tuning back in. I create content surrounding beauty, fashion, and lifestyle. So if you guys... I'm tired of saying that. Yes, I know you're tired of hearing it, but this is your first time hearing it. I'm also recording with my four-year-old, so if you hear someone speaking in the background, it's Jaden. I create content surrounding beauty, fashion, and lifestyle, so if you're interested in topics like that, make sure that you guys like, subscribe, and share. And today's video, as you guys can probably tell by the title, it is a Target spring haul. I love Target. I love shopping at Target. I mean, for, for so many reasons, like clothes, household essentials, literally you can get everything at Target, so I love it. And it's accessible to most people, it's quite affordable. In today's video, I'll be sharing some items that I picked up from their spring collection. I'm actually planning a vacation with my family for April, so I wanted to pick up a few things for the vacation and like, now after getting the pieces and trying them on, there are some things I'm going to take back, but I did want to share them with you guys just in case you guys were interested. So without too much rambling, let's get right into it. Okay guys, so I have my phone in my hand because I'm going to look on the website to just give you guys all the details of all of the pieces. So the first item that I'm going to show you guys is this piece right here. It's a maxi dress. This is from the brand Universal Thread. I got it in a size large and it's their balloon long sleeve tiered dress. I'm actually going to link it down below. Everything that I'm featuring in this video will be linked down below. I want you guys to see the length of this dress. So I'm five feet tall and it hits me a little bit below, like hitting me right at my ankle. So I think it's a pretty good length. When I'm out like on vacation, I can see myself easily wearing this with um, some slippers or some sandals, you know, something like that and be totally fine with it. This is obviously in the color brown. On the model, and I'll pop up a picture, she's, I guess, average height. I'm a little bit below average height. And it hits her like around where her shin is. So if you're taller than me, you will be able to have like, obviously it will hit you at a different length than this is hitting me right here. But this dress, the reason why I got it is because it reminds me a lot of a Target dress that I bought last year from the brand Who, What, Where. And I'm gonna just take it out my closet. But I loved this dress. It was one of my favorite dresses. So this also is tiered, but it doesn't have as many tiers. This one has one, two, three, four. This only had um, one and two. But one of my favorite dresses, every time I wore this dress, I would get compliments on it. It's a little bit lighter in terms of the material on the top than it is on the bottom, the one from last year. Whereas this one, the material, I feel, I find this material is a little bit thicker. I got this in the size large. I'm content with the size, however, if I wasn't busty, I probably would go down to a size medium. Not only for the length of the dress, I have a lot of extra fabric right here, which I don't need. But because I have bigger arms, like it's not going to be form fitting, but you guys see what I mean. Like I have extra fabric. I have bigger arms, so it fits my arms really nicely. I feel like if I got a medium, it'd be really tight on my arms, it'd be really uncomfortable, and I wouldn't like it. But yeah, here's the back. I have my mirror here, so I'm going to be checking myself out in the mirror. I really like the dress. Let me know what you guys think about the dress down below, and let's get into the next Okay, one. guys, so here is the next dress. This is also from Universal Thread from Target. I find that Universal Thread pieces are a little bit more simple. They don't have a lot of, like, bold patterns or silhouettes or prints, um, like the other brand Who What Wear does, which I'll be showing you guys a few of those pieces. I'm grabbing my phone now just to give you more details about this dress. It is their puff long sleeve tear dress. This also comes in two colors. This comes in green and it also comes in a really nice orange. I'm considering the orange. I've been actually really liking like orange colors, red colors. I mean, the dress that I had last year is red. I guess you guys know I do like red. But oranges and even like this color is a little bit out of my comfort zone. I'm trying to bring more color in my life and I like to experiment with color more in the springtime. I am a New Yorker to the core. My wardrobe mainly consists of the color black. It is very versatile. If you work in the service industry, they encourage you to wear black. So I'm trying to step myself out of that because I literally almost always have only black in my wardrobe. And in the summer and spring months, it's just like so blah, so boring, and it makes you hot. So without, let me stop rambling about the color black. Let's talk about this piece. 
very very cute so it has this really nice detailing on it maybe I'll do like a clip of me showing you guys like the detailing of this dress that I'll pop up to the side but it makes it a little bit more luxe more luxurious up the shoulder if you desire this piece also has pockets puff sleeves it hits you well it hits me right a little bit below the knee because of my height but if I was a little bit taller it probably hit me on the knee that are when you buy things that are really affordable it is totally fine to get it take it home take it to the tailors just kind of personalize it a little bit more for your size because like I said I am short so I do have to get some of my pieces hemmed but even if you're a little bit taller you might find just tweaking your inexpensive pieces just makes it look a little bit more luxe and also allows you to just it's gonna look better on your body and you will wear it more often this one is $27.99 really great price and currently right now there is 20% off of dresses on Target's website they do this a lot I got 20% off last week and 20% off this week so I'm going to try to post this video before this week is over so you guys can see these pieces get some of these pieces let me know what you think about this piece below this is actually in the size large I'm going to show you like a little clip maybe like on the side of me trying it out in a size medium. I got two sizes just to see which one worked best for me. Let me know which one you think I should keep. I probably will lean more to the medium but we shall see. Okay guys let's get into the next piece. This is from the brand A New Day. This is actually their long sleeve ruffle hem dress. It is in the color peach and it is in the size large. So. Um, I'm going to be honest, this is not the most flattering piece for me. It's not my favorite piece. I find I just have too much hips and too much, um, I have too much hips for this piece. The pockets hit me right where my hips are, so it kind of like doesn't like smooth out this area very much. It's not very flattering. I think though, if you're someone who's not as hippy as I am, this would be a really cute piece on you and they come in a lot of of colors they come in blue this really cute blue print actually I wouldn't wear that that blue print but the light yellow is really cute they have a purple print oh that one's actually really cute um they have another print in mint which is similar to the last color that I wore for you black and this one here peach I love the color I think the color is really cute really great basic for medium and you know brown skin I think it's a really cute basic but just it just doesn't work for me now the material is also really really nice I think it's very light for it to be a long sleeve or like a mid sleeve item and for it to be kind of like a midi size like it's hitting me like a mini dress in a way so it's very breathable but it just is not the best um silhouette for me another thing that I noticed about this item is that it gets wrinkled really fast when I saw someone reviewing the product on Target's website. She styled it really nicely, but I can tell that the item was wrinkled. And I think it's just by nature how this fabric is. It just, even if you steam it or iron it, if you move around in it, it's going to wrinkle. If you sit down, the wrinkles are going to pretty much stay. Like I, I steamed this dress and then put it on and there's wrinkles in it just from me getting it over my head so that's something to consider if you do not like your pieces to look really wrinkled this is not the best for you i'm a mom um i move around a lot i do a lot of things with my son like most mothers do looking wrinkled is how do i put it i don't like to look wrinkled but it happens so i like to avoid having items that easily look right okay so we are here with the next piece this dress is also from a new day this is the woman's striped sleeveless smocked waist dress i have it in the color black and white but they have a ton of colors i have it in the size large and this dress is also 27.99 yeah they have a few different colors so i just want to go through the colors with you they have white they have pink they have black they have teal that teal is really nice and the white is really nice too and I think I might switch this out for white um Mom, blue they also have oh my goodness they have a really nice blue printed like a printed blue they have a really nice light yellow they've been doing a lot of light yellows this year and a burgundy the burgundy is printed so let's get into this dress right now this also has pockets number one I realized that this dress because of my height although it does look nice I think it's a really cute dress 
I could get away with wearing a medium, so I'm going to order this in a medium. I do like it. I like the silhouette. I think that it's very breathable. It has this like waist, like it scrunches in a little bit at the waist, so it's really, really flattering. But because this dress I think is a little bit big for my size, it's not really doing anything. It's not really, you know, shaping my silhouette or fit into my silhouette. For if I'm going to get the same print, I do like the print i don't have anything like this in my wardrobe but i don't know if i would like wear it as often as if it was white or like a yellow or like a basic color because yeah prints are i feel like are really hard to wear multiple ways but let me know how you guys feel about it down in the comments okay, so let's get into the next piece so here is a dress from who would wear brand i've been speaking about this whole video this is the short sleeve button up trampeze dress i got it in the color cream this also comes in a ton of colors but a lot of their colors are sold out online the only color that is currently available in the size that i currently have is white it's like a white polka dot it says white but it actually looks kind of cream and i have a feeling that the one of the polka dot dresses that i have is like that same color like it says white on their website but it looks cream but it is actually white so take that in consideration I'll pop it up so you guys can see what I mean. But this is in a size large, and I personally feel like, um, not that it doesn't fit, because it, it definitely does fit. It does fit. But because I'm busty, I am like a 30, I think I'm a 38H. I find like, if I'm moving around, like you can kind of see. And I know it's like really not a big deal, and usually I wouldn't really care. This is the most expensive dress out of all of the dresses. This is $36.99 which is still a really great deal for a dress. I mean, the dress is $40, but I'm just not obsessed with it the way that I thought. Okay guys, so here is another dress from the brand Who Would Wear, and I'm giggling because I actually was very excited about this dress. I was excited about the print. It looked really nice on the model, and I thought it would be a really nice piece for me to have in my spring, summer wardrobe. This is from the brand, like I said, Who Would Wear, this is their polka dot puff sleeve dress. I got it in a size medium because I ordered this after ordering a few other dresses and I realized that size large can be a little bit big for me. So I decided to order it in a medium. And not that I, in certain areas it fits me nicely, but in this area ah. here, it is too small. It's so cute. dress, I think it's really cute. I think if I got it in the right size, I probably would like it a little bit more. This is did I say, did I tell you guys the price is $37.99, so it is $40. Who would wear line from what I like noticing right now, it's a little bit more expensive than the other lines at Target, but I find a lot of my who would wear pieces do hold up really well. I really like the material. This material is a little bit thicker than the other materials of the other pieces that I have. I know that it's gonna wash well, it will last well, but unfortunately it is a no for me. I suggest getting your regular size in Who Would Wear Pieces because they're pretty much true to size. I think this fits me like a 12, 14, which is my size. Whereas some of the largest and the other brands like um, Universal Thread. Universal Thread, the size large kind of fits me like, like a 14, um, 16. They okay, so here is the next piece that we have here. This is from the brand Who Would Wear. This is also, I don't know what phone call that was, but I accidentally just canceled it. I will call them back. This is from the brand Who Would Wear. It's their balloon long sleeve tie back dress. Yes, it has two ties in the back. That detail is really what got me to buy this dress. I got this dress in a size large and I reordered it in a size medium. So those are coming in. They're not gonna make it before I finish editing this video, but um, maybe I'll post it on my Instagram page. So follow me on Instagram. I will link it down below. So here's the dress. It is very cute. I think it's really nice. Very lightweight. Nice material for the spring. This is $39.99. So this is actually the most expensive dress here. It is not a maxi dress. It is more like a midi dress. And I really like it a lot. So I have it in both of the colors that it comes in. It comes in the color yellow. And it also comes in a polka dot color. I will show you guys that one um in a moment but yeah it's a large it's too big i can tell by the waist it just is a lot of extra fabric here and again this is from the brand who would wear 
and I'm getting a medium in this, but the last one I needed it in a large. The material is different. So this is the problem sometimes when you order online. Even when you read the details about the item and they describe the product, sometimes like not being able to touch it and see it in person really does make you make, like you pick out the wrong sizes or you have a different idea how the item might look. But this is just kind of the world that we live in right now. I don't think you can even try on clothes in any fitting room in the stores that are open. So even if I did see this in Target, I wouldn't have been able to try it to see how it would fit. But at least if I saw it in person, I probably would have been able to see it and say, you know, I'm going to get a large in that material, but get something smaller in this one. Because I know just by feeling it that this material is very um, breathable. It does have a little bit of stretch in the waist and I would have sized down for me. Like, look at this. Like, there was no way if I was in the store, I would pick this up and be like, oh, this is a good fit for me. Although it is a large. There's no way. Um, um, I'm clearly in my shapewear, so <laughs> that's why I'm covering myself. But I did want to mention, someone did ask me in the comments a while ago if I can do a video on shapewear. And I wanted to, but I don't wear as much shapewear as I used to because, you know, we're in a pandemic. I don't go out any place, many places, so not wearing much shapewear. But I will show you guys some shapewear that I'm wearing right now because it is from Target. It is from the Spanx line. It's basically like um, subsidiary for the Spanx brand that they sell at Target. It's much more affordable. It's not the best quality. It's not like Spanx quality because even the, um, you know, that sticky part for the band, for the waistband, it already like came off. I think it came off the second time that I washed it. But it still is a nice pair of Spanx. It's really, um, you know, good, thick quality and, and it does smooth you out and it's quite affordable. And they have it in the color brown. So I will link it down below for you guys if you guys are interested and let's get into the next. Okay guys, so this is the last dress of the haul, but this is the same dress and a different print. This is in the black and white print. I want to check on the website to see if this black and white, I feel like it looks cream. So they say that this is cream. It is not cream. Like this is a black and white dress. <laughs> like it's straight up black and white. So I don't know where they're getting cream from. It is not cream. And it even looks cream on the website. I'll pop up a picture of the model in it because it looks like a whole different color. Maybe let me know if you guys agree. But last year Target dropped a polka dot dress that I could not get, them, get my hands on. I was so upset about it. It was really, really nice. So when I saw that they dropped the polka dot dress this year, I had to get my hands on it. This also has the tie back detailing. They also have this print in another dress. I'm gonna see if I can, if it's still available. I feel like it is. But if it is still available, I will link it down below because my sister actually purchased it in the black and white, the same print but in a different style. And then I saw this and I got this and I thought it was a dress that she had, but it wasn't. So I'll link it down below. I'll pop up a picture if it's still available. So if you're interested in this, um, Print, but you want a different style that is also available i like it again really nice piece i love that it has pockets but unfortunately it is okay big. so this is the lingerie that i have for you guys this is from universal thread this is i think this was 15 dollars. the top is 15 dollars. the bottom is 35 dollars. so you get a whole sweatsuit for under 40 dollars, and i think that is a really really great buy this is the dropper pants universal thread and the shade dark gray shade dark gray in the size large and also universal thread sweatsuit sweatshirt in the shade dark gray also in a size large i mean what can i say it's really cute very simple it's a sweatsuit like i'm not supposed to be wild about it but i actually like the silhouette i like the shape i like the material it is warm but it's not like very heavy it's not like you know sweatsuits they have that very I don't know if it's fleece, but they have something on the inside that keeps it really warm. This is really great for the springtime. Like, I can see myself wearing this just as is in the spring here in New York City. Here is the back. I think it's really cute. Nothing too crazy. This is more like, although it's dark gray, it has like an acid washed effect to it. If you guys can see, it's not like a classic dark gray. But either way, I really, really like this piece. I think it's really cute. It hits me right on my ankle. This sweatsuit that I can wear on the plane for our vacation. We are taking a plane. It's my first time being on a plane for over a year. I want to be comfortable. 
I want things to be covered. <laughs> so I'm really, really into this piece. Very cute. Let me know what you guys think. Right. So here's the same exact sweatsuit, same exact size, just in a different color. I actually really like this color a lot. Again, I'm trying to get more color in my life. So although I had to get gray because it, it's not black, you know, at least it's not black. I had to get a darker color, but then I decided to get something a little lighter. I like this piece. I think it's really nice. Looks really great on my skin complexion. Also, when I tried this on without any makeup, you know, without any of the works, I did like it as well. And I think that's important. Like, I always try my pieces on with no makeup because a lot of the pieces that I like to buy, I want to wear it on my every day to day. And I do not wear a full face of glam like this every day. Especially now that, you know, Every time we go outside, I have to wear a mask. Usually my face is covered anyway. Even if I do have something on, it might be like, you know, mascara. Maybe, maybe I'll fill in my brows. But that doesn't happen that often. I'm trying to work on that. Trying to work on having a little something done on a daily basis. But try to try on your pieces without all the works. And if you still like it, then it probably is a really great piece and it fits your body really nicely. Okay guys, so that is it for today's haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I love doing these cute little hauls for you guys. And I love Target. I probably will be doing Target hauls for as long as I create videos here on YouTube. Because I just love Target. I mean, who doesn't love Target? You can get every single thing there. Like, I go there. I can shop for myself. I can shop for my son. I can buy things for the house. I mean, Target has everything. And they have some really nice designs and a lot of really nice brands there as well. So I hope you guys enjoyed all the items that I tried on, I will link down below in the description bar. So be sure to check those out. If you purchase anything, let me know. Let me know what pieces you really, really liked and which pieces you think I should take back because I already know what pieces are going back to Target. But I just want to know if you guys agree with me on some of the pieces that I wasn't crazy about. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure that you like, subscribe, and share this video, of course, if you enjoyed it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate all the love, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.